<laughs> but yeah, I'm with you. I think it's I think it's a little cold out yeah. there this morning because we're basically down to the freezing mark for quite a few spots. Mm -hmm. And tomorrow morning is going to be pretty similar. Yeah. Uh, we've got potential once again for those temperatures to be dropping. That is why we do have the freeze watch in effect through this morning and into tomorrow morning. So let's start off by taking a live look over downtown. We're dry for the most part. We are going to be a little cloudy as we head through the day today. Not a ton of sunshine, but we might get to see a couple peaks here or there. So zooming in right now, mostly dry again. We've got a little precipitation off to the north where temperatures have dropped even colder. We're transitioning from drizzle to possibly a few snowflakes here in central Ohio, though mostly staying dry for now, but we will see another round of spotty showers develop after the lunchtime hour. And it's actually ironically thanks to high pressure. Normally we talk about high pressure and we're going to see sunny skies and warming temperatures. Today we're seeing some cool temperatures and some spotty showers. So this is a very weak high pressure that's going to be slowly moving across the region over the next couple days by Wednesday, right overhead of us, keeping us a little bit drier. But as we head into Thursday and Friday, it slides out of here. That's when we start to see our temperatures drop and we'll be watching our next chance for widespread showers. That's what we see as we head into Friday and the weekend. So a little bit soggy, another similar weekend, but at least for today, we are starting off dry, cold, but we're warming things up. Highs will be in the lower 50s by this afternoon with spotty showers, spotty sun. The thing to know though with this rain that we'll see today is it's going to be very limited. If anything, it's drizzle. You might feel a raindrop or two. See a couple on your windshield as you're driving around. Uh, allergy index today, not fantastic. We're high for tree pollen, high for grass pollen, and moderate for mold. We'll be staying that way till this high pressure moves out and until that cold front passes through to bring us some fresh air, excuse me, as we head into the weekend. All right, your hour by hour forecast. We're starting off this morning. Again, temperatures down close to freezing for most of us. Skies partly cloudy. As we head into mid morning, we start to warm things up. That's when we start to see our rain arrive. Now it does look pretty widespread here, but what I want you to remember is that these pockets of rain are going to be very light and they're going to be moving around throughout the day. So if you feel a couple of raindrops, wait five minutes and you'll be dry. We'll see this off and on through the afternoon. Skies do slowly start to clear at times. By 3 p.m., we've got our daytime highs happening, 52 here in Columbus. Through the evening and overnight hours, skies are going to be slowly clearing. We're getting rid of that rain for a little while, but that's also why temperatures are dropping. By 6 to 7, we'll be down to the lower 30s. We might even see a couple spots in the 20s by early tomorrow morning, but we warm up fast. By 9, 10 o'clock, we're already seeing temperatures back to the 50s. So relatively, we're on the warming trend. We saw potential for a few of those isolated showers as we head into your Tuesday. We're going to be back to the 60s and a little bit drier by Wednesday. Another chance for showers by Thursday, some spotty stuff. Widespread heavy rain, though, starts to set in by Friday and continues as we head into Saturday. We'll be slowly drying things out as we head into Sunday and Monday. So your seven-day forecast, not horrible. I'd say we're going to get more sunshine as we head into Tuesday. Wednesday, clouds start to thicken back up. Still a little bit of sunshine possible on Thursday. That rain sets in later on Friday and sticks around. Saturday, going to be rainy, kind of gray, and that does stick around into Sunday as well as Monday of the following week.